We'll begin this edition of Breaking News with some breaking news coming in. The Chief Minister of Telangana, K. Chandrasekhar Rao, is addressing an emergency press conference in which he says he is going to expose Operation Lotus. Let's cut across live. ఎలక్ట్రానిక్ ఓటింగ్ మిషన్ల మీద కూడా అవి ఉన్నన్ని రోజులు మాకు మా బీజేపీ గవర్నమెంట్ డోకాన్ లేదు అంటారు ఎంత నిస్సిగ్గుగా ఎంత నిర్లజ్జగా మాట్లాడతారా మాట్లాడుతున్నా Telangana Chief Minister K. Chandrasekhar Rao, in fact, holding a very sudden press conference at the end of Vipol in Munugod, which was in fact a very high-pitched battle. But what he's talking about is not the Vipol, but the alleged Operation Kamal, as we call it, some kind of an operation to try and uh, purchase uh, TRS MLAs. This is something that we had reported on that happened as an operation at a farmhouse in Moinabad. on wednesday evening last wednesday evening and uh, subsequently the hyderabad uh, the cyberabad police had booked cases saying that there was a conspiracy to in fact uh, buy mla for 100 crore rupees first mla 50 crore rupees for each of the other three mla now what the chief minister has done is to set up this press conference and he's addressing it uh, with the uh, four so called target mlas also seated along with him other senior leaders also with him on the uh press conference guys and he is in fact set up screens and he has warned the media people that it's going to be a long night for them because he is going to be showing all that footage what he has also said is that he is sending the footage uh that they have uh, shot uh, as part of a sting operation to try and expose uh, he is naming the bjp directly and saying that yeah, they are indulging in these kind of practices and he says uh, that uh, he is sending that same footage to not just uh, you know he is sharing it not just with the media here in hyderabad he is also sending it to the chief justice of india uh, to all the judges from the supreme court to all the uh, chief justices of all the high courts in the country and all the judges as well and he says to media houses also he is going to share a copy and he is also sharing it with the chief ministers across the country and he has appealed to the judiciary to say that they must uh now look at what is uh, happening in the country and must react to it he in fact gave examples of uh, what happened uh, uh, you know when uh, indira gandhi who was at one point of time thought of as invincible and when uh, she had imposed the emergency how the country had resisted and he says uh, a similar kind of uh, uh, movement is required now because here of course uh for uh, time and again has been talking about working towards the bjp mukh bharat but today he says it is with a heavy heart that he is putting all this video footage uh, uh, in front of the people and he says uh, that uh, the kind of practices that they are indulging in are uh, very shameful as of now i must point out that uh, no direct uh, link to the bjp has been established from either the uh, Uh, any of the evidence that presented by the uh, by the uh, police or by the government or by the cmo for, for that matter as of now but what the chief minister has said is that all this video footage that they have which was not earlier presented as evidence has now been sent to the high court where as you know uh, the case uh, had come uh, because the police had appealed after uh, the remand uh, of the three accused in this case was uh, rejected by a lower court that of course was in a technical issue of not uh, issuing a section 41 notice but subsequently those three were remanded to judicial custody and are in fact in jail uh, in hyderabad but the chief minister now going to share what he says is very explosive kind of uh, material he said uh, from what we know i must show to point out that the audio leaks that had happened earlier whose uh, authenticity we cannot independently uh, vouch for or they have not been independently verified those audio leaks had suggested a conspiracy and uh, in that we heard voices uh, supposedly of those uh, accused in this case uh, talking very uh, uh, you know in uh, very casual terms if i may put it that way uh, they were taking names uh, of uh, uh, central uh, party leaders the top leadership of the bjp they were mentioning uh, the organizing secretary and as though they are in close touch with them and that uh, they are a team who work throughout the country and that in fact the chief minister in his press conference mentioned that these three accused and uh, 
uh, admitted that they had multiple Aadhaar cards and that they were deployed for this very purpose. The Chief Minister also made an earlier uh, you know, reference to the fact that the Prime Minister had gone to Bengal and uh, uh, said uh, at a public meeting that he's in touch with the uh, uh, ruling party MLAs there and he also pointed to uh, uh, the BJP central leaders coming to Munugod and talking about, uh, uh, you know, uh, creating a danger for his own government here. So, the audio leaks per se uh, had suggested some kind of a conspiracy to topple his government, uh, but who exactly is involved in terms of proof, not yet uh, clear. But the Chief Minister now, uh, first uh, explaining what he uh, had to say about uh, uh, the content of uh, those uh, tapes that he is going to play out for the media. Uma, do stay on with us. Let's quickly listen into what he's saying. I mean, Rose Mag Nichakuchame Mita M. Rakutam and Zuskundam Security would have been provided on Japan. I mean, he category security some more. We go in ED Ral Mimiki, income tax Ral, me security would have Maja Bajata, state security Ral, central security system. I would have Y category system. Category of the video of Nakatangalu. And the Yenta Rajanga, the Sektula low, Bartha Prabutu Mundi. E Rajanga, the Sektul Jesuna twenty. Talking about the contents of uh, the uh, sting operation and the uh, video and audio leaks that they have. And he's saying that those people who have been, in fact, uh, successfully caught in a police operation and a sting operation, those people had in fact promised the MLAs that they would uh, uh, be given uh, Y category security and that once they come into the radar of the, uh, of the uh, BJP, they would be provided complete protection uh, from the CBI, from the ED, from the IT. All those, of course, are mentioned by an accused in this particular case. Uh, that's what the Chief Minister is quoting, but I must... Uh, uh, also pointed as we are saying this that uh, those accused, the, uh, the BJP has said that they had nothing to do with the, uh, uh, the accused had nothing to do with their own party. And uh, they have also denied that they were acting on behalf of the BJP. But the Chief Minister is still sharing those details about what, uh, what those uh, video audio tapes have. Delhi Amadmi Party will declare it. Chief Minister, referring to the Amadmi Party, reacting to those audio leaks, Manish Nisori had, of course, held a press conference and he is uh, saying that uh, in the audio leaks there was this mention of uh, 43 MLAs of the AAP also being in touch with them and the Chief Minister is saying. If the kind of numbers that are being spoken about uh, is anything to go by, the enforcement directorate must first uh, inquire and investigate uh, into how they are talking about uh, crores of rupees, hundreds of crores of rupees uh, that they will pay out in order to buy the MLAs or post the MLAs or ask the MLAs to convince the MLAs to quit their own parties, parent parties like the TRS and join the BJP or quit the Amadmi party and join the BJP. Sorry. Now, uh, defending, in fact, his own government because uh, there have been uh, BJP leaders, central leaders who have also pointed to him saying that he had uh, destroyed the Congress by uh, uh, taking 12 MLAs from the Congress uh, after the 2018 elections. Uh, KCR explaining, saying that his own party had managed to get more than a three-fourth majority and it was only on the appeal of certain Congress leaders who wanted to shift parties uh, that they had been taken in and also that they had not uh, uh, violated provisions of the anti-defection law. So if they come to our state and uh, 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 you know, come up with a conspiracy to topple our government, are we going to be quiet, the Chief Minister is asking. Baris tell me, which border? A Judah manu, Chivar lele na watlaar kuda vaakya maara kuda. Time baagu tarari. Jai jai student. Acharya vayabu. 
అంతే కదా అందరూ పంపిస్తున్నాం మేము దేశవ్యాప్తంగా పంపుతున్నాం జుడిషియరీ స్పెషలీ Uh, the chief justice of the different high courts said one we want him to take cognizance of this case he says he in fact also appealed to them earlier uh, saying that uh, it's the judiciary that we uh, uh, repose our trust on and uh, we are expecting them uh, to uh, come forward and uh, save uh, the pillars of democracy as he called it All right uh, Uma Sudhir please do stay on with us this is an emergency press conference by K Chandrasekhar Rao in Hyderabad where he says that he is now going to show proof he has circulated that proof and shared it with the media where he says that operation lotus was in full swing where agents were luring TRS leaders uh, to participate in operation lotus MLAs were promised why category security and he claims that all of this uh, with the help of proof uh, is available and it is being made available he then says that the enforcement directorate must probe into the huge money offered uh, let me now introduce our guests and the moment we get that footage when we start getting that footage we will cut across live uh, our guests on screen right now alok wats leader of the bjp rohan gupta of the congress party siddharth sharma of the aam aadmi party uh, and uh, uh, mr shridhar of the trs is also with us thank you very much First of all uh Mr Shridhar would you like to tell us what exactly do these tapes show what is the allegation to begin with uh the entire country have seen in the last week the BJP leaders those who are in the you know form of swami ji's and few middlemen on behalf of the bjp national organizing general secretary taking their name Love. and bjp top brass name they have contacted trs mm. party mlas mm. and they offered huge sums they offered 100 crores per mla and asked them to join mr BJP. reddy is this on tape is this absolutely. what you are presenting as proof absolutely this was this was recorded the our mls the moment bjp leaders have contacted our mls so you set up the, the cameras police. is it of course come again no i am saying that this is a sting operation which the trs leaders carried out the moment they contacted our mls they have informed police police have taken all the evidence entire trans entire discussion whatever okay. they have spoken their offers and they also have gone to the extent of you know we will directly call the number 2 in the union government now we can give you all kinds of protection the moment we contact you that means you are in this canner of bjp's national leadership hmm. we can contact when we, they have taken the repeatedly the name of mr bl santosh the national general organizing general secretary of bjp but And who are these agents would you like clear. to would you like yeah, to tell us you know i i'll go across to mr alok what's in just a short moment but uh, who are these people there are there is one mr ramchandra another one is one mr nanda kumar who is uh, sorry i lost your audio mr shridhar okay i'm going to come back to you no, we lost no. your audio uh, alok no, no, what's 
You have heard these allegations. Now apparently tapes have been released. I'll come back to you, Mr. Shridhar. I'll come back to you. I'll come back to you. Let me get in a response, Mr. Alok Watts. People who are allegedly speaking on behalf of the BJP tried to lure members of the TRS to join the BJP, and in return, will get Y plus security. They said that you will, they will be, you will get protection, and you you will get lots of money. All of this, the TRS alleges, is on tape, and that tape is with the police, and they call this proof of Operation Lotus in Telangana. Your first response. And this video has now been released. It's with the police. It's been given to the media. Yes. Let the let let us first see the video, and see what is transpiring in that video. Huh. Then we'll come to a conclusion. But. First time that I have heard earlier, I used to only hear of the allegations. This is the first time that I'm hearing that somebody has a proof of Operation Lotus. Whether those people involved in it, are they in BJP? Are they connected to BJP? All this is yet to be proved. But yes, if there is a proof and it's a concrete proof that BJP was involved, then BJP will have to bear the brunt. Mr. Singh, but I don't you, think... you're, you're questioning on whether these people are actually from the BJP, or is this some sort of a personal enterprise of a few who had nothing to do with the BJP? Maybe uh, it's, it's it's yet to be proved they are from the BJP. Who What's your allegation? People? What's your allegation? Maybe that TRS maybe, is thinking itself that they have set this up against the BJP. See what has happened in Pakistan. Some people told me that uh, Imran Khan himself got somebody to shoot there. So anything can happen oh, in politics. Oh, even God. before probe, you, <laughs> Mr. Reddy, how would you I'm, respond, Mr. I'm Reddy? Just, I'm just you yourself have stung your own people. Sanket, those who have come to That's the negotiate, allegation. those who have come to negotiate, Mr. Ramchandra Bharati, and one Mr. Nand Kumar, who is a Hyderabad native, very close to the Union Minister of Tourism, Mr. Kishan Reddy, and one, there is one more person, also you know, is a seer from other state or something. They, the, those three have come to a farmhouse and they were caught red-handed by the police. Today they are behind the bars. They are in the jail. Now they will be tried. Now our chief minister conducting a press conference and all those details which are with us, the tapes and everything has been sent to the all you know judiciary and all the chief justice of high court and we will be sending it to the Supreme Court chief justice and all media houses also. The country will see the true colors of BJP and they also have claimed. We are in. We are negotiated 43 MLAs in uh, Delhi government. Sooner we are going to collapse Delhi government. We are also going to uh, break, uh, destroy the Rajasthan government. That is and being made, Mr. Mr. Reddy. The point is being made. How are you so sure that these are leaders linked to the BJP? That's the point that Mr. Watts uh, is asking. Sanket, I am very clearly telling you. Oh, this one thing is clear that care. they are not BJP leaders. No, no, no. One minute. Talok ji, one minute. One minute. My bola charao. The I know Mr. Nand Kumar. They are very, very close to the Union Minister of Tourism here. At the same time, two other people, they are said to be very close to the power circles in Delhi. And they have claimed repeatedly, they have claimed the name of the National Organizing General Secretary of Bharti Janta Party. And they were talking about two, three. They were also claiming that they can give the MLAs who join BJP immediately uh, the Y category. And you could have okay. really, really, you know, seen that. And all these things will come out. Uh, very soon in the public, in, in, definitely the truth will come out. The BJP. You have Are seen. you going to present and this in the court? I mean, the, the the police is investigating uh, because this is related to the elections. Will this proof be given to the election commission? Of course, definitely we will be giving it to all concerned authorities. And I would also tell you in Telangana, while this Munugodu by-election was happening hmm. for the last 20-30 days, one one and a half month, BJP state president says that we are going to collapse. Uh, you know, TRS party government. Their parliamentary board member, Rajya Sabha member, Mr. Lakshman, says that we are going to bring out, you know, one uh, Eknath Shinde from TRS party. Then another M legislator says that there are many TRS party MLAs who are in touch with them and they are going to join BJP. And these were the comments. And their union minister also says that now we are there are many BJP, TRS leaders are in touch with them. They will be joining BJP. And only taking them into confidence by seeing their, by listening to their comments, now you can easily understand with what sort of confidence they were claiming all this. Okay. They know these kind of. Okay. So from what, Goa, one, 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 one
what we have gathered mr kcr k chandrashekhar rao of the one more mr k chandrashekhar rao of the telangana rashtra samiti has presented what he calls is proof of operation lotus in the by elections in telangana where you have allegedly exposed two people who are close to the bharatiya janata party top leadership who are trying to lure your leaders with lots of cash lots of money and y plus security and were asking you to join them correct this is the this is the allegation quickly sandeep siddharth sharma of the aam aadmi party wanted to come in very quickly and we'll go back to the press yeah. conference yeah very quickly sanket uh, this thing what the what mr kcr is saying aam aadmi party mr satender jain and mr manish sisodia have already been pressurized with the same thing when they were called for interrogation point number 2 uh, very very it's a farce that bjp is playing the bjp spokesperson just now on tv said that they don't know anything about operation lotus in karnataka way back 10 12 years ago when mr yadurappa started off with uh, breaking congress he bjp wears the operation kamala as its on badge of honor so bjp has been doing operation lotus it has done in karnataka very recently it did in goa very recently it did in maharashtra it has tried doing it in ama with aam aadmi party in delhi as well as in punjab we have been saying it and today kcr has provided proof for it bjp is nothing but a gang of kidnappers and the moot question the question that the uh, that the viewers would li like to ask is as mr kcr said 100 crores is being offered from where this money is coming to the bjp scoffer is it siphoning off the gst for our kids for the milk and the wheat roti that the gst bjp is charging is it siphoning off to its own party coffers and trying to buy mls across india uh, uh, alok what's quick response BJP before i go back to that press conference we have started to get the feed again yeah alok what's your response providing good proof for it mind your language before saying something you are calling us gang of looters and gangsters hold your tongue don't use such words and let me tell you one thing it's just an allegation nobody has got 100 crores it's just a conversation and where the money was coming from if they had but, but, taken but then you would have come wears, to know but bjp wears operation lotus as its badge of honor in karnataka it started it, it it itself says that we conducted operation lotus it is not somebody else's words it is bjp's words that thing operation lotus has come into the although, lexicon of although, politics till, after by bjp thing, itself it is bjp's words to us till date all those Sankhya who have come with us till date from any quickly because party. i have to go back to the press it's conference started started again it's not a new He's thing taking questions and answers yeah mr reddy quickly see they went on to say that they they are they are going to they have a team of 20 men who is doing the same job for the last many years they have collapsed many governments they broke many governments they bought many mlas they also have said you know we can manage even ed and cba also not coming after you they also said that they will be you know managing it also not coming after them so this is the kind of operation bjp is following the modus operandi in many other states it is not the first state right we have seen them in goa we have seen them in manipur we have seen in them in tripura we have okay. seen them very okay okay so this is perhaps for the first time that somebody is claiming are, you know, on on record with the help of what they call evidence of operation lotus in the form of video about whatever evidence we have we have been we have been sending our chief minister sir is sending it to all the media okay. houses okay okay no. okay you yes, shared that will will The, that that video cd has jail. been those tapes have been shared by uh, k chandrashekhar rao in this press conference let's quickly cut across live mm -hmm. and listen in once again to what he's saying of every democrat every democratic thinker and i expect honorable supreme court cj garu and also honorable judges of the supreme court honorable cj so, sir uh, all high court sir rao in fact uh, played out those tapes uh, for a few minutes after which he said questions. that since the audio Whatever is not very clear in such a hall therefore the he is uh, shared them please punish the culprit whosoever it is this kind of open purchasing of mlas dethroning governments they openly say in this video we have already dethroned eight governments and how we conducted the operations 
Now we are in the process of dethroning four governments. That is Telangana, Delhi, Andhra, and Rajasthan. They said the number of MLAs managed also. Which state, how many MLAs are managed? Our people are already operating, they are there. They say everything so shamelessly. So this is not an easy task. So this needs to be looked into with great concern. Praja Swami Vadal Andar Kuda Dai Cheshi is a Tivra Mana Vishanga Pariganichi. Then Nikoga Vishamik Manu Yastam. This Chinasana Vishanka Induku. Then Gauronil and a Bartha Pradhana Mutikarki. Bartha Unathana Yastam Yoka Andarna Mutraku. And the last time, Chief Justice in the one piston, Nante, shall a strong reason on the Guinean. Will a phone lepre the police see Jason Row? Will a call that a motor t-shirt? Okoro Seritragadu, two thousand fifteen.